Man, we're gonna offer our condolences to Jada Young and my other another young brother lost, man. We hate to see this going on in the community, man, and it's spreading like wildfire, man. The rappers, our young brothers, they dying every day at an alarming rate, man. We hate to see this for Jay the Youngin, man, right in his hometown, man. As they always say, man, your hometown, that's where the most hate gonna get built up in and where you got the most animosity built up towards you, man. And then they saying that it was an ongoing back and forth beef, saying that it was another rapper, some situations. Jay the Young and had with some other guys in the town or whatever. Then my thing is, man, if you know you the only one really around there getting money, you know what I'm saying, then you come from a background where it, it, that's what it is, you know what I'm saying? So it's really programmed into this guy. So, man, a lot of game, I feel like this young brother should have soaked up by that house being on that main street, that blue C8 Corvette, probably the only one for so many miles radius around. Then they know it's your car because you done posted in videos, you done posted all on IG, and they know it's you. You know what I'm saying? So, man, I just hope, man, this situation can die down. Then we hear about the shooting that happened after the situation. Another car was shot up in retaliation, and they saying on the news that this was a retaliation shooting. Then they also had shootings going on at the hospital down there in Bogalusa. So, man... You got to just pay attention, man, when the crime start going up, man, these police going to get involved. A lot of lives will be lost, man. A lot of families will be devastated because whether the person dead or the other person go to jail, man, them loved ones are lost. So, man, we need to wake up and look at all these situations on the front end, man, and, uh, and just pay attention to what we're doing. We can't keep falling victim to this.